your partner in MRO tools. The extremely lightweight housing is made of high strength aluminium. The standard square socket adapter is equipped with a quick release and can be removed effortlessly to allow for easy turning and changing. Direct fittings can be used as an alternative to the standard square socket adapter. The socket is secured with a bracket. The hydraulic connection rotates 360 degrees. Another option is a two-axis hose connection that rotates and swivels. Next, connect the torque wrench to the bled hydraulic hoses. Press the button manual to switch on the hydraulic power pack. For the correct pressure setting, refer to the torque table of the torque wrench. Press and hold the button manual with the power pack switched on. Set the required hydraulic pressure using the pressure adjusting valve. Release the button manual now. Bolting in the automatic mode requires that the power pack and the torque wrench be subjected to a calibration process. The values measured during the procedure are used to control the bolting process. Press and hold the automatic button. The automatic calibration process commences. Once the calibration process is complete, the indicator light stops flashing and comes on permanently. You can now start the automatic bolting process. Start by setting up the reaction arm. The safety latch allows the reaction arm to be removed and prevents the reaction arm from being unlocked by accident. Place the torque wrench on the top of the bolting position. Make sure the reaction arm is properly set. Let's take a closer look at the MXEC. Made of high strength material, the safety cylinder allows for high levels of pressure in a lightweight housing. The ball joint connection between the lever and the ratchet provides for a perfect transmission of the generated torque. The long-lasting fine tooth ratchet system prevents the ratchet from jamming even without the completion of a full piston stroke movement. The relief valve releases the pressure exerted on the housing if the pressure rises to an impermissible level. To start the automatic bolting process, press and hold the automatic button with the power pack switched on. The indicator light comes on permanently as soon as the bolting process is complete. Manual bolting does not require a previous calibration of the hydraulic power pack. Alternate between pressing and releasing the button manual until the nut stops turning when you press the button and the set pressure has been reached. You should complete an additional safety stroke to ensure that the required torque has been reached. When releasing bolts, in particular corroded bolts, you may experience that the bolted connection is loosened in an abrupt manner. Let us take another glance at additional device properties at this point. The ball joint of the piston provides for an almost lossless transmission of the piston stroke to the lever and is capable of autonomously detaching and reconnecting in the event of sudden loosening. The integrated release shock absorber protects the housing from sustaining impact damage during an abrupt release. The piston separates from the lever and reconnects automatically. This reliably prevents the piston lever connection from rupturing.